I want to fight, Una. I feel like you're forcing me. I disagree. I just don't want to have to deal with my family and your family all alone. Let's make a commitment to stay together tonight. Yeah, that's not codependent. We need to find my mother. Let her know we're here. Okay. Well, big brother. Nope. That's you're staying in shape. Not flying this mission, mission solo tonight. Oh my god. Oh, Jackson, Jackson. It's your creepy cousin Pat. The one who's always talking about really gross stuff. I think we should go in the other room. Seriously. Uh, yeah, like maybe. Oh my god, before she gets here. Go to Baluna! Hey, hey. Stop it, Sean. You're an adult. You know there's only one way to stop the tiger. No. <laughs> sister, sister, magic word. Uh, you are not seven, and I am not a little girl. Only one way. No. Only one way. <laughs> okay, stop, Breebree. Stop. Chakalaka head stop. Was that so hard? I am not a little girl, Breebree. Brett, Brett. Why can't you just grow up? Where is the fun in that? Uh. Milky Pants. Hey, Milky Pants. Merry Christmas. Good to see you. Una bananas. Mm. Yeah, okay. I love you too. Jackson? Jackson. I was just thinking. Una, hey. Hey, Pat. You look really pretty tonight. I like your hair. I have a boil on my butt. Sometimes I can't sit down, so I have to get on my hands and knees. I pretend I'm a cat. Oh, okay. You want to see it? It's no, all pussy no. and Listen, good. Pat, I could stand here and listen to you, but I'm just not going to. Listen, I need to help Jackson find his mother. Have you seen Lillian anywhere? Um, Santa Claus hats are for the Lewises, and the sweaters are for the visitors. Okay. Has anybody seen Lillian? Anybody? I've seen Lillian. Ah, huh, Cousin Quentin. Cousin Una. He'll spoil your dinner. Oh god, disgusting. Also, they're just decorative. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? I'm gonna remember this next time you need a ride home from your boyfriend's house. Are you threatening me with needing to walk five blocks while high? Hmm. I'm Quentin, and I really liked this music long before it ever became big. Hmm. And I'm gonna tell my beautiful and wrathful cousin Una exactly where Lillian is lurking. Wow. This is how you talk to people when they cross you? Threats and snarky remarks? You've got serious growing up to do. What did you just say to me, you spawn camping little twist? She's in the living room. Okay. Nice hat. I don't think that my turkey from last Thanksgiving was a little bit dry. <laughs> and no, I don't agree with the magazine article you sent me about the bleak odds of a woman my age ever getting married. <laughs> oh, crap. Do you have a boil on your butt, too? No, Pat, I do not. Oh, missing out. Hey, look, I found your phone. In this day and age, a cell phone is a required element to further any relationship. Okay. Uh, I well, think that there's going to be well, well, a time well, when well, we're going to be able to call thank you. Okay, one goodbye, another. Okay, goodbye, goodbye, goodbye. Okay, goodbye. I, I would okay. like your phone number, please. Okay, that's great, Pat. Really great. Okay. Oh. All right. Jackson. Jackson, can you hear me? Hey. Listen, this is not what I meant when I was talking about us staying together. Yeah, I, uh, I turned around you weren't there, but... Uh, that doesn't make any sense. I mean, what have you been doing? She's well, I hope you were at least easy on the poor sap. I, uh, tried. Well, why don't you try again? I badly. Uh, I gotta go, but I'm, I'm gonna see you in a few minutes, okay? Just okay. talk to Mom. Now I know you're having a breakdown. Maybe the two of you can uh, actually agree on something. I love you, my half, Nelson. Bye. Lies. All lies. Hello, Lillian. Uh, hello, Una, dear. Were the sweaters and hats your idea? Yeah. I thought it would be a fun way to keep track of who was part of the family and who was, you know, temporary guests. Uh, oh, but I see that you were unclear as to the item that was appropriate. 
Alex, uh, could you fetch a sweater out of the bag, thanks? Jackson is my family. Well, I must be getting old, because I don't recall you walking down the aisle with my son. You know what, Lillian? I really don't feel like letting you bait me tonight, okay? Can't we just respect the fact that we both love Jackson? Well. Okay. Come here, I have something for you. Something from Jackson. You know, when he was young, I used to keep all the gifts he received until I was convinced he was deserving of it. And um, that little routine was the standard, even when he wanted to give presents to somebody else. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, God, I have changed. <laughs> Not going to be baited. Try that one again, won't you? This is how I am proposing to you. You're Jack-Jack. I honestly don't know why he thought that was romantic. <laughs> he can be such a meathead sometimes. Can't argue with you on that one. Yeah. Though, a meathead like this is going to require a spirited little witch like you to keep him. You know what, Lillian? Mm -hmm. I agree. I'll see you later. I did not enjoy being left alone, but I do think that my holiday ended up just right. Oh, good. I was hoping the two of you and I... Yeah, I think Lillian and I came to an understanding. Did you stay out of trouble? I tried, mm. but no. Uh, never mind. I don't even care. Let's just get out of here and go grab a burger. I could murder one. <laughs>